Kimo. Super Indie Sunday Podcast is back. We switched it up a little bit on y'all. You feel me? This music is on its way to y'all. Let's go. We are back. Let's go. This is Lock It. Unreleased music. Produced by DJ Kimo. The fun. Eric Atmosphere. Ozzy Joel. Let's go. Y'all already know how we do. We break records here. Hope y'all been doing good. We tired in the motherfucker. Social media is very, very important. Not just your presence on social media, the consistency of how you keep your presence going. And not just that, the quality of how you're presenting your presence. Because no matter what you are doing, I repeat, no matter what you are doing, what kind of business you are doing, marketing and promotion is the leader. It doesn't matter. You could be selling leaves off the ground. It's about how you market and promote it. Because somebody else could be selling the same leaves. You feel me? So shout out to them for getting that done and getting to work. And they, they on their way up, man. Um, As far as financials, I know a lot of y'all, you hear me like, oh, content videos, this, that, and the third. It's about your, your scheduling. So if you know you love this music, you love this music. But you ain't making no money off this music now. And you know it takes money to get the music done. You got to create a system. If you're going to door dash, whatever you're going to do. You can't have enough, You can't have so much pride. So I want to tell you all about DJ Q because he just got back. That's one of the reasons we haven't been together. Somebody threw him a bag. And he thought he was going to go to cor- He thought he was going to go to corporate life. We're going to talk to DJ Q about how that went because he's right here next to me. DJ Kimo, how did that corporate life go? That money looked good a week, but what's going on? How that? What's going on? <laughs> yeah, yo, cause so, you are music, so I don't know what you thought you was gonna go do. Yeah, 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 nah, nah. It was a quick little bag. I ain't gonna put no companies in out there, but it was a nice bag. We just had to go up top, had to go get that real Where quick. you went at? Went to Philly. He left. Atlanta went to Philly for the bag. Left Atlanta went to Philly for the bag. It was it was a nice little bag. It was a Big corporate bag. bag. Nice little corporate bag. You know what I'm saying? I had to I had to switch it up. You know what I mean? And uh, you know I had to put you know just take the DJ off the name and get real right with it. But uh, man, what happened? It ain't the same. It just really ain't the same. Like you know, at one point. You know, it's crazy because this isn't the first time. Like, you know, it's a seasonal situation. And I did it before. 
And the first time I did it, I was in a different spot than I am now. So I was like, yeah, hey, this is cool. It's good money. I'm rocking. I could do this. But being that I leveled up more, you know, and obtained more and seeing my progress and then going to that, it was almost like a sellout to me because I felt like, damn, I'm better than this. I'm bigger than this. I could get a bigger bag on my own. So I felt like it was worth saying fuck it. You know what I mean? It was cool. I got the bag, but... It made me want to put more work and go harder to the grind, to my to my dream, to what we doing, to what I'm building with y'all. So that's the most important thing, man. You got to stay true to you. Get the bag. Stay on your hustle. Get it how you get it. You got to flip burgers. Do what you do. Anything means to get the bag. However, never sell out to your, to what you're doing. If you're really doing this and you really want to go hard with it, you got to stay put, stay locked in, and stay focused. Because whenever you feel like you're drawing away from it, because it got to that point, it, it was like either the bag, or, or, or what I'm building, you know what I mean? Because it, 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 it wouldn't let me do both. See, that's how life get. You can do it, but at some point, you're going to get to that crossroad where you're going to have to really make that decision. And that's going to be the test of when you, if you really, really want to do this or not. Because it's like that. Because the money was looking good. I ain't going to hurt But you back here with us. But I'm back in, and I'm like, fuck that. Let's get it. We can get a bigger bag going Damn this. Right. So let's get it. Damn right. Damn right. Man, give yourself some claps. You got the clap loaded?